Hi everybody, this is Rachel with Para Junkies Fan, and today we are going to be talking block quotes and border radiuses. So what we are going to do is we're going to do it in Blogger. So right now I am back in my Blogger and I'm going to go to Template. Then I'm going to go to Customize. And now we're in the Blogger Template Designer. And if you look, I just have a basic standard template set up. And we're going to go to Advanced and add CSS. You're actually going to be writing CSS on this one. Now, to get those rounded corners is a CSS called Border Radius. And if you would like your image in only your post, because I wouldn't recommend it because that would mean everything else would be rounded, but I would suggest maybe just your post. If you want those images to be rounded, you would type in po post an image, and then you would type in border, radius, and then you'd pick your size. So let's say 25 pixels. And you see how it automatically, oh, that's kind of big, don't you think? So let's go maybe 15 pixels. And then you close your CSS. Now, also the other thing that you could do a rounded corner in would be your block quote. Now I have it set up that this is a block quote, but it's not showing anything because it's not formatted. So again, formatting a block quote. Now it's a standard um, in Blogger, so you don't need your little class period. So just type out block quote, and let's give it a background of, let's say, a gray color. And you see it appeared. Yay. Okay. And then, um, because you can't see it, let's give our font a color of white. And then we're going to add some padding. And then we're going to add the border radius again. And then close it. And you see now you have a nice formatted, formatted block quote and nice image formatted. You can increase your padding. You want it to look. You can even do a lot of a lot of the times I do a left margin, so it kind of pushes it away. Why isn't that working? Of course not. Sorry, you might want to increase that a little bit more. I don't know why 25 pixels didn't work, but um, CSS is can be a little tricky, but um, I'm going to copy and paste this into my um, Book Blogging 101 post so y'all can have it, but that's it. And you just hit Apply to Blog, and then when you go and look at your blog, all your changes show up. And that's how easy it is.